Hi, friend. Today I will show you how to make high quality and professional grade 6.35 mm or 1 quarter inch stereo jacks jumper cable. These cables have different applications. But the most common jumper cables are for guitar pedals or PA recording systems. These jumper cables are also called patch cords. This tutorial is useful not only for making patch cables, but you can use it also for making longer 1 quarter inch balanced audio cables. To make such a jumper cable you will need two 1 quarter jacks, they come in different types, ranging from a few dollars for a pair, to several tens for a pair. I use two Nutric NP3XB stereo plugs, because the Nutric connectors are high quality, and they are easy to soldering. You will also need a good quality audio cable, with at least three wires. I'll use the Klotz My 206, it has a good shielding, a good price, and it's a very flexible, flexible cable which is just right, what you need for an audio patch cable to last a long time. You will also need various tools for the job, and of course a soldering iron. The first task is to cut the audio cable, here it is important to find out how long you need this patch cable to be. Slide the two connectors boots onto the cable, as you won't be able to do this after soldering. Then stretch both ends of the cable to straighten the excess cable outer jacket. Then measure how much outer jacket needs to be removed. Remove the outer jacket with a sharp paper knife, but be careful not to cut the internal wires. Then separate the ground wires from the center cores, twist these ground wires to form one ground wire. Cut off all fabric threads so as not to interfere with soldering. Remove the insulation also from the center wires. Do the same for the other end of the cable you should end up with something like this. Tin all three wires, so that they can be soldered better and easier. Also tin the jack contacts. Use a multimeter to find out which contact is ground, left and right. Fit the cable and pinch off the excess wire lengths. Solder the ground wire to the correct contact. Solder the left and right wires to the correct contacts. Then solder all three wires, ground, left and right, to the other jack. Check with a multimeter that there is no short circuit, and that the wiring is correct. Left to left, ground to ground, and right to right pin. The result I got at this moment is the following. Use hot glue for both jacks contacts, to avoid dangerous short circuits in the future. Next position the chuck onto the cable and align chuck with plug finger. If you also have a cable with a diameter larger than 5mm, cut off the plastic of the spacer. And screw the connector tight. Then do the same for the other jack. Here's the result. A custom build high quality audio patch cable. If you have any suggestions, criticisms or questions, feel free to post them below this video. As always, I'd appreciate a like and subscribe button for this video, which will motivate me to make another good D video. Good luck.